2014 I was accepted to Bond Uni um, as part of a Transformer Accelerator program with a business idea I had and I actually had the opportunity to pitch um, to a shark tank of potential investors including Steve Baxter from the TV show Shark Tank and that really ignited my own passion for uh, entrepreneurship and I thought I don't like the idea of running a business myself but how can I use this in teaching to nurture young entrepreneurs in high school. So that sort of started my journey into entrepreneurship and I then took up a master's in that field researching it with high school kids. So the focus of my master's research was looking at two different entrepreneurship education programs conducted with high school students. One of them was from $20 Boss. By the end of the program, students valued education around entrepreneurship much more highly. A lot of them didn't even know what entrepreneurship meant before taking part. And by the end, they were like, wow, I'd love to do more of this. I'd like to investigate running my own business. A good thing that came out of it too was um, they were more confident presenting to others because as part of $20 Boss, they had to run their own business stall and sell products to fellow students um, and teachers and they also had to budget that $20 and spend it on something. So they pulled their resources together with other students, ran their own little micro business, and then they made money. And the money they made went back to charity. So they were like stressing about their budget and they were like, oh my God, I don't know how to work a budget. So it was the first time a lot of them had had that stress around money. It was a really good experience for them to see what it was like managing a budget. So there were a lot of really great skills that they got out of that. Prior to taking part in a program like $20 Boss, the kids were fairly clueless around money. They were like, oh well, mum and dad just give me some money to spend, I'll just go and spend it on what I want. If I'm short, they'll help me out. By giving them $20 each to spend on their own business, they really valued it more and made sure they, they did a chart around, oh, this is a table of how much I've got to spend. I'm gonna shop at different supermarkets to see what price I can get. It definitely transformed their thinking around, oh, it's only $20. It became, wow, how can I use that $20 wisely to make sure my business makes as much money for charity as possible. By having the money, it definitely reframed their perception of what that $20 is. It's not just a piece of plastic. It is more than that. It symbolises a lot of things. And it can stretch a lot further if they use it wisely rather than just throwing it away. If you're going to do research in particular, you have to have a passion. And that's what drove me. I wanted to find out how entrepreneurship education transforms children's experiences and I really wanted to push for schools to do more of it. So by finding out that there was a positive impact and that students valued those opportunities, um, I could use that as evidence then to push schools to do more of it, to give students the chance to take part in these real life entrepreneurial experiences. And not just as a standalone experience, but how can we embed that in our curriculum so students are armed with those transferable enterprise skills for life beyond school.